Hello guys, welcome, it's me again. On this video I want to talk about Cyberpunk and I'm going to talk to you guys about the life path that you should choose when you start playing new game. There is three different life paths, Nomad, Street Kid and the Corporate one. Now basically I chose the Street Kid but I do regret because I plan to play the game a second time, even a third time so I can experience the three life paths. So I think that the Nomad one is the best choice that you can make because basically the first six hours of your gameplay are going to be on the desert and just imagine how it's going to feel after six hours of gameplay playing on the desert, you know, not, not getting to see the night city and then you just get to see your first view. I think that will be amazing and you will have to farm more with that life path because basically when you go to the night city it's not that people are going to respect you and stuff like that because if you choose the corporate one or if you choose the street kid one people will know you more because you was grown there so basically personally if I would get a second chance basically I would choose the nomad one and I think that you guys should choose the nomad one especially if you're planning to replay the game after you already completed it once Going on. So, first of all, I want to talk to you guys about what's the difference between the life paths you choose. Now, the Nomad one, you're basically part of a gang which are that are raiding fuel like stations and stuff like that in the desert. What do you want? And Just basically, it's not that you will have a reputation, and it's not that people are going to respect you, you when you so move to the that. night city. Get but on the, the other hand, if you choose the street kid life path, most of the people who know you already and you have a reputation there, so it's not going to be that hard for you to interact with the with the characters from the game. But if you choose the corporate one, of course you're rich and everyone respects you, basically. But if you're looking up for a challenge, I would suggest you guys to start with the nomad life path and then you can start with the street kid and then you can start with the corporate one but basically it's going to be really really long so if you're just trying to enjoy the game if you're not looking for a challenge you probably can just like switch to the easiest mode and you probably should choose a street kid life path but it depends on your view you can do more research about that so you're for certain sure which one you would like more. Now I hope I was helpful somehow and I hope you enjoyed it and see you on the next one.